It's demonstration time. Who's ready to watch? It's going to be so fun, you guys. So it's Jen. Um, I just wanted to pop on here and show you guys all the many uses of one of my most favorite products, and it is Shadow Sense. So if you've used Shadow Sense before, drop in the comments. I would love to hear your experience and love to have you share with everybody else. Um, so Shadow Sense is amazing, you guys. It's long wearing, it's anti-aging, it has our skincare in it, and um, it's water resistant, so you can go swimming. You can use it for so many things. So I'm gonna show you some of the things that you can um, do with Shadow Sense, okay? And oh my gosh, it comes in so many colors. This isn't even including all the colors that I'm going to use today. I have all those separate, but here is all the colors. This is everything that's currently available right now. Oh my God, you guys, there's so many. <laughs> So, okay, I'm going to get going here and show you guys some of the things that you could do with Shadow Sense. So all I have on is Color Correcting Tinted Moisturizer Mascara, and I put on one coat of Lip Sense, um, and that's all I got. So I'm going to get started. Um, one of the things that I'm going to do first off is I'm going to use Shadow Sense to um, conceal any darkness underneath my eyes, okay? So you can use lots of different things. Today I'm going to use Whisper Pink because I kind of have a pinkish tone to my skin. You could also use Candlelight or um, Snow is a good one. So you have lots of options. So here we go. I'm just going to start and throw a little bit of this under here. I'm just going to use my fingers at first. Start tapping that in. But with it being a cream to powder, you do have a little bit of time before it sets like one to two minutes, depending on how thick you put it on. Um, the thicker you put it on, the longer it's gonna take to set. But generally, one to two minutes is about right. So, I'm gonna let that set, and now I'm gonna go ahead and do some contour. So, for contour, I'm gonna use Mocha Java Shadow Scents. You could also use Rustic Brown or Garnet. Um, you've got lots of different options. Um, so, I'm just going to take just a little dab here. You really don't need much at all. And it just blends so easy since it's a cream. So a little bit of contour on my cheeks. I am gonna do just a little bit up here on the top too. I've got the contour done. Now I'm gonna do a little bit of concealer. So I'm actually gonna use just a little bit of candlelight shadow scents. I'm just going to put some around my nose here where I'm a little red. Look how good it covers, you guys. Like it just covers so well. And it's not going to budge. I'm a little bit of blush now. So I can take so many options with blush, you guys. We have so many different colors that you can use. Um, I've been really digging using Pink Posy. So I'm going to use that. All right, so check that out. Just a tiny little dab. So there's my blush. Swoop, done. These little shadow sense tubes are going to last you a ton of time. Now I'm going to just, I'm going to start doing my eyes and I want to do just something a little bit fun. So um, I'm going to take some orange shadow sense. So now I'm going to pack on some color. So to pack on some color, my sunrise eyes. All right, but you see how easy that is? You can just pack it on and blend it super easy. It's not complicated. Now I'm gonna take a little bit of Garnet Shadow Scents.
So the next thing that I'm going to use Shadow Sense for is going to be eyeliner. But so I just took an eyeliner brush and I'm just gonna go ahead and create that line for eyeliner here. But see how smooth that goes on? It's super easy. There we go, done. Next. Okay, and I'm just pulling this off the wand. And that's it, that's done. So simple, you guys. Another use for Shadow Sense. <laughs> I'm gonna use Smoke Topaz Shadow Sense on my brows. There you go. Isn't that easy? Oh my God, it's such a game changer. Shadow Sense is just so easy to work with for your brows and then they're gonna last you all day long so you don't have to fuss with them. Now I'm gonna do some highlights. Um, warm gold shimmer that I used here on my eye. I'm gonna barely put any on. See that? And I get that nice highlight. Ooh, that actually turned out pretty good, yay! <laughs> that pink posy that I used on my cheeks, I'm gonna use as my lip color. I've got just this little wand here and I'm gonna take the Pink Posy Shadow Scents and I'm gonna pull the color right off the wands and I'm gonna put it on my lips. There we go. So let's recap. What did we use Shadow Sense for? Some concealer under the eyes, a little bit of highlight, a little white highlight kind of underneath the eyes, contour, blush, concealer, brows, um, eyes of course, eyeliner as blush or lips. Um, and I'm sure I forgot something, but you guys saw the video. <laughs> If you guys have any questions, just let me know. And um, thanks for watching. We'll talk soon.